A youth student is fighting for her life after getting caught in the crossfire. And new tonight, there's a possible critical clue that could help catch the shooter. Local 10's Janine Stanwood is live in Southwest Miami Dade with the video. Janine. And loved ones say she is still here in the hospital after having been shot in the head. And now people who live near the scene say this video could be a clue. New video showing a white car crashing into a pole. Then watch five people take off running. One appears to be holding a rifle. It's surveillance video taken just minutes after the shooting of 21 year old Ashley Rodriguez. And it could be a critical clue as she fights to survive. You can always remain anonymous, okay? Police working the case say the FIU student was driving the night of June 13th near Southwest 232nd Street and 112th Court when people in two other vehicles began shooting at each other. She was caught in the crossfire. We have a description of one of the vehicles, which was a white Mercedes, but there is no description of the other one. This car that crashed less than a half mile away and four minutes after shot spotter technology recorded the gunfire does appear to be a white Mercedes and the homeowner who has the cameras tells us detectives are looking at the images. Police won't say if there's a connection, but they do tell us they are following all leads. Here at Jackson South is where loved ones say Ashley is recovering. A GoFundMe has been set up for the young woman described as vibrant and hardworking. Miami-Dade police telling us tonight that this is still a very active investigation. If you have any information, give them a call or Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. We're in Southwest Miami-Dade. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News. Today, thanks a lot. Only